Police in Cadaver Dogs descended on a California landfill this morning to resume the search for the body of an infant whose parents have been charged in his death. Officers converged on Tuesday on the El Sobrante Waste Disposal Site in Corona and proceeded to comb through the area to try and find the remains of six-month-old Jackson Manson. Police previously scoured the landfill in late February, around the time arrest warrants were issued for Jackson's parents. Adam Manson, 34, and Kiana Williams, 32, have been charged with one count of child abuse resulting in death. Authorities believe the parents were doing drugs in a motel room on December 31, 2018, and later found their son dead. According to police, Manson and Williams then put baby Jackson's body in a suitcase and tossed it into a dumpster. Investigators suspect the contents of the trash receptacle ended up at the 1,300-acre landfill in Corona. A witness reported seeing baby Jackson inside a blue 2006 Chrysler PT Cruiser in South Los Angeles's Hyde Park neighborhood on New Year's Eve around the same time his parents were allegedly spotted breaking into cars on the street, according to KTLA. Williams and Manson spent the rest of the day getting high at King Motel, where they were staying with their son, after leaving a shelter for homeless families. According to newly released court documents obtained by ABC7 News, sometime later Manson woke up to find his son dead in his sobbing girlfriend's arms. During an interview with police, Manson was quoted as saying that Jackson was hot to the touch and his limbs were limped up the child was unresponsive and not breathing. Williams told police that she attempted to perform CPR on her son, but he could not be revived. The couple who admitted to being habitual methamphetamine users, reportedly said that after their son's death they stayed in the room for a second night and continued doing drugs. The child's mother described for the investigators how eventually she clothed Jackson's corpse in blue pajamas, wrapped him in a gray blanket, stuffed the body in a back trash bag, a pillowcase, a duffel bag, and finally placed the whole bundle into a rolling suitcase, according to the court papers. The couple told police they considered several potential sites to dispose of their infant's body, but ultimately settled on a dumpster at Baldwin Hills Plaza. Both Manson and Williams are being held without bail. Their arraignment is scheduled for Thursday.